G'day and welcome back for more Escape from Purgatory and it looks like Kanajashi's wheels are trying to escape as well. Uh, yeah, they're... This wasn't how I designed it. <laughs> you might need it's a Slightly spammer. outside of uh, allowable tolerance. Yeah, yeah, that doesn't look right. Um, <laughs> bags not being in the cockpit when you disconnect? Uh, hmm. I think, I think you're going to have to give it a chance and... Try and disconnect and see what happens. All right. Um, Come back. You might want to watch. Okay. Let's see. I don't think it'll do anything wrong, but it could be. Yeah, that's oh. what I thought. A little bit okay. of a derp there. Okay. That looks then... semi-normal. Yeah. She's good. All right. That was the. <laughs> that was. Uh... That was something. Since we were last here, I've gone and collected a bit more ice, and it I think with the amount of ice we collected, I hadn't actually noticed, but I think we collected enough hydrogen that the shuttle's actually full. Oh. Yeah? Yeah, it's full of fuel. Uh-huh. Well, so, that's good. It looks like the batteries are charged too. I thought I would um, propose a couple of options for what we can do today. Uh, and one of them will appeal to your bloodlust. One of them will... <laughs> <laughs> which, uh, of which I know Catback has plenty. I'm filled with lust for blood. Yes. Uh, did you want to go and attack uh, an assertive base? Use these new weapons we've got access to. Uh, speaking of weapon, how are we looking for ammo munition? Oh, we got heaps... Like, there's at least a couple of hundred of ca hundred cases hanging around. I don't even have a gun. This is the mass magnesium we brought back last time. Yeah. And this is the first time we've gone on recorded since they did the warfare update. Yes. Yes, it is. So we've got all the new guns. Wait a second. Like this one. Shouldn't my turrets be... Grabbing ammo from the base. Are they piped? They should be. Is one of your cargo containers damaged? Not sure. From all those times you smashed everything else up. Hey, I didn't <laughs> smash nothing. <laughs> yeah, you did. You smashed into my mining rover that was. I don't see any right. mining rover, therefore there's nothing to smash. Which gun Therefore it can't for? have been mean. Ipso facto. Cargo containers are intact. Oh! Ah! Help! Whoa! <laughs> I just sunk into the floor. <laughs> Wait, where? Good job. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I don't know why your guns aren't pulling ammo. Have you got the guns off? Is that why? Yes. The guns cannot pull ammo when they are off. Uh, okay. Well, I'm worried yeah, about turning, turning them on. on. So, Kenjashi. Um, mm -hmm. I was thinking if we go and do a base assault, your survival kit trike is probably a really good support vehicle if you want to add a gun to that. Oh, a gun to this. Because we're going to need, we're going to want a respawn point that's close. Um, and we don't want to get the, the uh, shuttle shot up. So that could be a good, good vehicle to bring along. And then we got Capax thing that's plastered in guns as another thing to keep that safe if uh and capac does have a seat on have a couple of seats on the front so i can just ride it in that mm -hmm. all right we'll just throw a quick uh, gatling turret on this thing yeah yeah we've still got like a hundred thousand kilograms of uranium or uh, uranium magnesium ore to be processed yeah 245 nato uh 25 mil ammo containers Wait, are they... Has something changed with the Gatling turrets? I thought they held more ammo than this. No, they only hold like four. Yeah, they're only holding like five boxes. Yeah, the small ones, that's all they hold. That's hardly any boxes. Correct, but they'll get destroyed quickly, so there's not much point in having more. Yours will get yeah. destroyed quickly. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Uh, let's see here. Have you guys got rifles? A couple smoking bears. I'm sorry? 
Have you guys got rifles? I just made one. Cool. And you've got some ammo for it? Uh, nope. Kavak, have you got a rifle? No. And turret? No. Oh, I need oh. to remove a couple blocks, that's why. That's right, Silly I Silly little that. white armored nubs in the way. That thief Splitzy stole all my food and water last time. Oh, uh, speaking of thievery, I collected up all of the um, space credits that were around. And I have deposited them into my account so I can buy us all of the food. Uh, I will... That is good. Do we just want luxury meals or do we want... What else can we get? That's nice. Whatever's the most bang for the buck. Yeah, I honestly don't know. I'm just going to get luxury meals. Uh, Kabak, do you have a beacon on this thing? A beacon on what thing? Because when I'm sitting in your rover, it says grid will be deleted for missing beacon. Uh, I'm pretty sure it... How is it even here if it doesn't have a beacon? Uh, maybe the beacon got destroyed and damaged and it's been locked to the base ever since. I don't think you got a beacon. Uh, should be ready to rock. I put a beacon on the back of it. Let me up. Oh, that's a horrible place to put it. I was going to put a matching one on the other side. Uh, this little thing? I think my little rover has a beacon. Somewhere. Yeah. I guess mine must have blown up at some point. It... So it definitely had one before. There we go. Got a pair of beacons on the back. Uh -huh. Don't crash too hard with your connector. <laughs> it's Jesus. a big ask for her car back. <laughs> you just gotta take all the fun out of everything, don't you? <laughs> Uh, weapon. Right, Where is this weapon? Rover here is recharging. In the assembler. What the? Make sure you bring an oxygen bottle that's full as well. Oh, I don't even know if I have a... Yeah, I don't have any bottles. You should grab one. I've only got a welder and a grinder. Well, uh, get some more stuff. Bottle. You're in the cargo. It's not hard. Oh, I've got an <laughs> oxygen bottle in my cockpit. Uh, that's why uh, must life be so difficult. Thing. What are these new rifles called? M uh... MR50A is the one that I made for you. Okay. Just type 50. I got it. Or what 20. kind of ammo does it take? I think I might have made the wrong ones. Yeah, these are S20 magazines. Yeah, there we go. I'll make new Jeez. ones for you. Somebody says they just found us. That's possible. Mm-hmm. Little does he know we're just getting equipped to go shoot stuff. Shoot stuff. Indeed. So, <laughs> he could be the target. <laughs> hey, what happened to your spacesuit? You look like a stormtrooper. What happened to yours? You look like a stormtrooper fell in a vat of... Oh, Kool-Aid. My suit's changed back again. <laughs> Jeez, it just will not sit still. We don't have a med bay yet, do we? No. Well, God, it's weird on. driving such a light rover, being able to climb this hill with no issue. Hey, come back. Wait, wait. I need to get in the chair. Huh? I'm riding oh. with you. All right. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's um, drive toward the sun. Well, I've got to navigate all these craters you guys have left in the ah. side of the hill. My turret's oh. shooting at something. What? I got yeah. contact. Better not be shooting at me. Oh, that's an unknown S signal just got taken out. Oh. That was my oh. unknown signal. Oh, <laughs> that's what it was. <laughs> Come back, your turret's on. Uh, I just turned them. I just turned them on to deal with the threat, and then I turned them off again when we discovered what the threat was. Ah. I'll just turn uh, it back but... on just because someone said they found us, just in case. All right. Yeah, let's drive toward the sun and we'll just keep driving until we find a base. Sounds like a plan. So my my plan at the moment with regard to what we're going to do is um, we'll have to use these rovers to take out any of the drones that the base might spawn as we get close in. So we leave Kanajashi's rover back a bit so we've got a respawn point 
and Capax move in, moves in a bit closer so it can take out um, the any drones that come by. Sounds like a highly tactical plan. Perhaps. But we'll see how well it plays in the real world. Mm -hmm. Maybe all this dust will clear up so we can see things. Perhaps. Perhaps, perhaps, perhaps. I mean, if we get lucky, we might find another one of those wrecked ships as well. Well, should I head up to the top of this hill, see if we can see anything? I would almost be tempted to do what I've said I wouldn't do when we found those wrecks previously and try and get one of them to be flyable. Um, no, no, stop. <laughs> I hear de worrying noises. Yeah. Um, just, yeah, don't see anything. Just keep heading, just keep heading toward the sun. Just cruise. Don't want to cruise too fast in my trike. What are you talking about? Three-wheeled vehicles are famously stable. <laughs> <laughs> ah, no way. I'll never flip this thing. <laughs> Foreshadowing. Well, you mean like the foreshadowing of me saying, I really hope my mining vehicle lasts more than a day this time. Ugh. <laughs> oh. No, 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 no! Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no! I got no! Uh, dodge! Oh. I dodged it. Oh, dear. Hmm. Is this something over here? Uh, it is a crater. Or a mining hole. Crater. Oh. That was definitely something. Oh, there oh, is something. Come back, there. turn off your turrets. Turn them off. I did. One of them's apparently not in the group. Don't make no sense. Alright, let's go in and close on that person's stuff. <laughs> Whoa, what the... That was weird. It's a modified respawn pod with wheels with a Who's trailer, it? a large grid trailer. Uh, oh. I'm on foot. I'm getting close. Oh, there's an Assert Observer base. That's what we're looking for. Ah. There's also a cert research. So we lure the observers over here and take cover behind... Uh, whose vehicle is this? Oh, a lot of hydrogen this is tanks. Twan's base. Uh, large grid ore detector. Oh, there's a bunch of buttons. Beep, boop, kind beep. Of shot it up, though. Yeah, just a little bit. Uh, shall we head to that research base? Uh, research or observer? Which is. Research, uh, I'd say. Which is going to kill us more. Uh, the observer base should. I can't remember if I put that in the public version or not. Yet. Go back. Where'd you go? Jeez, insider info. Went back to the rover. Oh, just head towards the left. sun. You'll see it eventually. This space, Betsy. Thank you. <laughs> You're gonna want to keep a moderate distance from it. Probably let Capac go in first, and then just follow him. Uh, which Sounds one? Research. like a plan. Yeah, research base. That's back the way we came. That's okay. That's good. If everything goes horribly wrong, it's less of a walk back here. Valid. <laughs> Alright. Gun's going hot. Same. Gun. Single. Going hot. Alright, so we're 1.7 away. All right, I reckon, Kanjashi, maybe you should park at 1k, maybe 1.2, and Kapak let Kanjashi get in the other seat. So if we leave the survival kit back here. Oh, base command has sent out a mosquito. All right. Um, so, yeah. Actually, Kapak, let me help out. You just killed me! What? Well... Isn't it useful we have a respawn point right beside us? 
Isn't it useful that before he can finish the sentence, let me get out, he gets out of the chair while I'm driving? Because I thought you'd stopped. <laughs> I think the server hitched and it looked like you'd stopped. All right, Sir Mosquito's coming in. Your health is critical. Well, I hope my guns are on. Low. Um, Panjashi, you don't have a vent on this thing. No. Oh, I probably should have done that. Yeah, there's no way to get oxygen from your thing. I hit it. I need to get on my body so I can get oxygen. Oh, Whoa. there it goes. I wonder if there's anything left. Doesn't look like it. There's lots of sparkly things in the air. Capac, you've got a vent on your cockpit, right? Yeah. May I hop in for a moment, please? Uh, I right, guess. So. so I'll park up... Where? There's a nice little divot over here. That might be a good place for me to park. Yeah, we may have to actually Hello. quickly manufacture a um, vent on your thing, Kanajashi, so that we can refill our bottles from the survival kit. Ah. Oh, oh no, I did refill. see the research. Hang base. on, mine did just refill from the cockpit. What the heck? Yeah, but can I try getting back in again? Just see if my bottle refills. Did you pick up all your stuff? Yeah. I just threw a bunch of low tier tools on the ground. Oh. Because I didn't want them occupying my inventory space. That is called littering. So is this. Hey! What the? Can't just leave your grey water on the ground like that. If somebody tries to drink it. <laughs> that would be a mistake. <laughs> a big one. Alright, so leave my rover here? Yeah, and then I think we ride with Capac a bit closer. Oh, it's too bad we can't shoot when we're in these seats. Yeah, we, we I mean we could stand on top of them and but I wouldn't do that with the server lag. Yeah, and with him driving? Yeah. I'm good driver. He's already murdered me once. Come back, remember, its turrets will hit you at 800 meters. Yeah, I know. So you As might want to drop us on this side drive. of the hill if you're going to drive into turret range. Uh, there's another dip on the other side. Okay. Fuel low. All right, here we go. All right, so do you want me to circle around and grab grab its attention while you guys attack? Um, yeah, you could. You can try that if you uh, game to. Losing the light. I'm not going to be able oh, to see no. the turrets. That's the worst timing. Oh, well, we can see their muzzle flashes, that's for sure. Try to not run you guys over in the dark. Oh, is it facing me now? Come on, silly interior turrets die. Oh, oh, that's not good. Did you take fire? Uh, it blinked me a couple of times. It went a bit laggy, so I kind of stopped in its range. I'm getting hits. Yeah, I think I am too, but I don't know whether I'm hitting the right stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, if all else fails. I've defeated more than one AI installation with sapping techniques. Nah, sapping's cheap. <laughs> no sapping. I mean, oh, I could okay. just turn on my guns and drive at it. I mean, you could. I thought you would have had you. Or we could hop in and we could control your guns. Like we could grab we the. We could take off and nuke it from orbit. 
Mm. Oh, yeah, up on the place. Let's see, to the left in the sky, you can see somebody's. Uh, yeah, that's mine. Signal. Oh no! Oh, cool. oh dear. Oh. Okay, turns out there's a big crater over here. Ow. <laughs> Just shooting it, muzzle flashes. I have no. Yeah. I can't see the base at all. No, I can't see anything. Uh, I need to head back to your thing. I'm down to 53 health. Maybe we should bring my uh, thing into this divot right here. Yeah, maybe. The other option is... Capac... Oh, unknown signal. ...has brought his truck, so... Which turret? Oh no! Low. It's shooting the unknown signal! <laughs> That's fine. Oh, mosquito, mosquito coming, coming in from behind the us. It's gonna hit my uh, rover first. Oh, Capac, go and support. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I think it might be crashing, Mike. Uh, yep. Yep, it's slam. Down. It's down. All right, I've got your front turret. The one that's behind yeah, my I head. <laughs> well, if you guys want to get some heals. Yep. Uh, do that, and then you can both load up and get the front turret so we can just charge headlong. <laughs> I think I might bring my... Would it... Would it... Be a good idea to bring my little trike into that divot we were in. Yeah, potentially. So we we have the um, uh, heels and stuff right there. Oh boy. So which turret am I taking? Uh, I would suggest taking front right. Front right. Control. Oh god, I can see my own head. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> shoot my shoot my own head. All right. Tally ho. All right, have you got the other turret under control? Yep. I don't know how well this is going to work, but it'll be interesting to find out. All right. We're going. At least your In spotlights the storm. should under help us. Under cover of the storm. Well, come back. Stop. Ah. You need to stop. I thought we were going to tank Drive it by. a Drive by shooting. What do you mean tank it? You're sitting at the front. Yeah. You guys are in the line of fire. I can't shoot anything at the moment. Because oh. everything's oh, on broken. fire. Because all the turrets are dead. I'm out. Uh, only one of them's dead. This there, base is not shooting back at us anymore? Uh, there is an active turret on the other side, I think. Well, that sort of worked. How many turrets did we lose of ours? I think I shot up a bunch of our own turrets. Ah! Ow! That hurt. Ooh. Yeah. I got it. And come on, got oh, it. My 20 health. Oh, there's a battery in here that's mostly charged. Breach and clear, breach and clear. So, what do we do? Do we turn this thing into a rover? <laughs> Ooh, ammo. Victory! Uh, someone, someone dropped some coke on the ground. Some cola. Ooh, oh, yeah, delicious. that's when I opened up a uh, locker. Yeah! <laughs> what are these clanging sounds I hear outside? I almost dropped an antenna on myself. That sounds about right. Inventory. I need to run back to my rover and get some heals. Inventory full. Inventory full. Because I am just about dead. <laughs> well, that, I thought I feel like that worked reasonably well. We just got to go back home and repair Capax rover. Surprisingly yeah. well, actually. Ah, oh, there's the, my rover. Uh... The field repairs are a bit of a pain without being able to grab. Yeah, we'll have to bring some stuff with us. I don't know how much value there is in grinding this stuff down. It's just mostly iron, eh? Yeah. Alright, I'll bring this rover over. Since the threat has been neutralized. Ah, uh, my turret's Whoa. still shooting at it. Oh. I thought another drone had come- Oh, another drone is coming in! Mosquito. Oh, we need to find the we need to find the remote control block. Inventory. I'll quickly turn my turret to shoot only small grid. Uh, Inventory. I think that mosquito is crashing. Inventory. Yeah, it looks about good. Can anyone see the remote control? Nope. Oh, I think I found it. Come back. You got a drill? A drill. 
I gotta drill. I'm trying to drill. It's not drilling. Ow. Oh, Somebody there's the remote. Me. There's the remote. Get that. Grind that one, camera. Cool. Okay, done. Mm, took a little bit of armor damage. <laughs> yeah, and I think I shut up a couple of turrets before I realized what was obscuring my view because it was so dark. <laughs> Typical. Oh. Oh, what was that? Uh, almost a very flat can of jashi. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Our first successful mission! Yes! Now yep, we get to eat the corpse! Mm -hmm. Took out some poor guy's house. Well, the base isn't far. Yep. We just pop home real quick and reset and get ready to go out to the next one. Maybe we need some kind of auto repair pad so I can just drive in and repair myself. Alrighty. That's it. Base is gone. Come back, may I hop in the cockpit to get oxygen for our drive home, please? Oh, if you must. Oh, that's the other thing. We should put a vent on Kanajashi's rover when we get back. Yep. That is definitely something we so should do. So that we can use the survival kit to do this. Because it is quicker. Oh! 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 What? What's that? That's a crater. That's a deep, deep crater. <laughs> that might have been the one I drove in and also has a warning GPS on it. Now we see. Can we get oxygen from your survival kit? Yes! He's better. So out of that base, I got a data pad. Oh yeah? What did it say? Re-requisition for parts. Why is this taking so long? We need the replacement components to repair the door to the waste disposal facilities. The shower equipment wasn't designed for this. Please send an update on the expected time for the delivery. We're getting desperate out here. Shane Jacobson. There you go. A little bit of uh, flavor there. Yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. You should continue this catwalk around the back here. <laughs> Grab some more AP ammo. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Why? Pop your stuff in the cargo container. What? No, I'm not killing myself to get out of here. Build build a ladder or something. <laughs> you can't. You're in the only block. No, build a ladder up there that I can reach and then I'll, like, teleport to it when I grab onto it. Yeah, that works. That's how I get on my rover in my survival series. I got a ladder I teleport to. No, that is not how you build a ladder. Yes, it is. What are you doing? Why'd you get rid of that? I needed that to get back across. No, you were trying to entomb me. Go the no, other way. There is no other way. <laughs> I needed to get stuff. You can go that way. I can see a way through. Yeah, then I can't get back out. <laughs> this is... I needed to... Uh, I was legit not prison imprisoning you down there. It is, in fact, so easy to get out that I have gotten out. Huh. <laughs> what, what were you whinging about? You trying to entomb me? <laughs> oh man. Imprisoning me forever in the desert sand seems to be a running gag that you enjoy. When did I last do that? Every given opportunity. Uh, do we want to go at night? Where are we going now? More attack ball things, I thought. Oh. We should probably wait until it's light. It was pretty difficult doing it in the dark. I almost exploded in the bottom of a crater. Yeah, that's fair. Well, instead of putting an extra seat on your thing, maybe I'll just make a mini rover. Why can I not get this connector to line? It was plugged in here before. Uh, you'll need to drop your suspension on the left-hand side. Oh. That's what I had to do. No wonder it was so wibbly-wobbly when I first... Uh Drove it oh out here. yeah, I probably should have mentioned that to you. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I was like, hmm, this thing's driving a little weird. Let me just reset my settings here. Yeah. Oops, my bad. There we go. No, it's, it's no worries. I'm really excited to see what they do with the next um, Warfare update. Yeah. I want more turrets. I think this game kind of needs like a rock, paper, scissors of different like weapon types and armor types. 
What I really I think they need to do, they should have done all along, was make some engineering required for placing turrets down. To, or to make them optimised. Mm -hmm. So, overheating, cooling systems, you know, that sort of stuff that has to be, that can be added to certain things to make them better so that mm, then there's right. a requirement for some engineering processes. Or like a, some sort of sensor array to improve their tracking. So you Yeah, want that sort of thing. You want power and efficiency modules for Gatling turrets. Yeah, basically. Would you like Actually, me to slap a, a Gatling on top of there? Yep. That's the plan. When we were testing the new stuff the other day, I had an idea for a, a new block. It might might be possible to, to mod in. What's that? What's that? You'd have a tripwire block. You mean a sensor? No, like a single block that's like a trip, like a thin trip wire that you could stretch across a hallway, and if you walk through, you get you get exploded. So a sensor and a warhead. Energy. Uh, yes, but without the an obvious sensor and without having to fit a massive warhead in somewhere and blow up half your base. Yeah. Something that was a small, fairly controlled explosion. You mean? An like anti-personnel personnel weapon. Yes. Yeah, having some traps would be really nice. Well, I, I think you could build that trap. As long as you had a a personnel mine, something that did very little damage to grids, but just wrecked whoever was there. Yeah. Which is kind of the rockets when they're in a... Like, the man-held rocket launches don't do much damage at, at all either. Yeah. My only issue with those things is that they take platinum and uranium, and it's like, by the time you have platinum and uranium, you probably already have a giant base. Yep. So I don't think they're intended to be an early game device, which I'm fine with. Yeah, but it was kind of what the devs said, like when they were doing their reveal trailer. They're mm. like, oh yeah, a person can just have a couple of these and they can be okay for a while. And it's like, well, no. You're never going to get them until you don't need them. Yeah. Like, all I'd like to see is you take the, the dumb fire rocket and you just make it just magnesium and uh, nickel and iron sort of thing. Yeah, and make, make a, an actual missile that's launchable from launches that's tracking. Yeah, yeah, and then the, like, yeah, exactly. They're the, the high, expensive ones. High quality one, expensive one with uranium and platinum. It's a tracking launcher. Give it so many degrees per second that it can turn. So if you make a hard, hard bank, it'll miss you. Yeah, I would actually like that over the current system. I know light armor is tissue paper, but it still makes me feel better. Oh, yeah. The sun was rising, right? Yeah, I thought it was vaguely close. Before the we... storm hit? Yeah. Oh, no. What's the oh, no? The, the lag while I'm tilting as I'm driving uphill. Oh. Because <laughs> I, I then know that my mouse isn't going to do anything for the gyros. And then I might have tilted all the way backwards. Would have been bad. Now we got a proper convoy out of here. Yeah. All right. Which way are we going this time? Uh, should we head towards the sun? Make sure we get it full daylight when we finally meet a uh, nasty. Well, it occurs to me that heading towards the sun means we'll have less hours of daylight. Yes, but I feel like we can move a bit far. Oh, well, fine then. Let's head away. I'll follow you. Except you're in last place at the moment. Yeah, and you guys are already headed the right way. Well, fine then. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Turn off. Turn off all my lights as it is daytime. <laughs> this, this buggy looks weird. Ah, but is it functional? Kind of. I guess we'll find there out when go. we attack something. Turrets activated. Ooh. This is a pretty serious installation over here. 
I got a badger suit. Serious installation. Did you find somebody's base? Got an API small signature. Well, I got 83 space credits. Whoa. Built by Warlock. Oh no, it's wow. the ones that runs away. <laughs> I hate these ones. They're the worst. There's a massive solar array, there's a bunch of wind turbines, and there's like a runway. So, speaking of runways... God damn it. Got away from uh, it. Uh, we probably need to start talking about going to space. I'm dead. What? You actually got killed? Warlock doesn't want visitors, apparently. Uh, is that kind of jashy? Mm. Different kind of jashy. Looks like a trike. Uh, following a ball. Uh, Stay which, still, you little ball. Which survival kit should I spawn at? Um, well, kind of jashy. Hey, it is one. you. Where are you, little? Your health uh. is critical. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Please Stuck press your now. button before it damages my rover. Um, yeah, can it What's happening? Right, you're here. There we are. Ah. Come back. Do you know where your rover is? Uh, I mean, I was in the process of making a GPS for it. Uh, let's see how far I got. So that's a no. Uh, Did I take any damage from that? I did. No, I've got it. Um, Kabak, neither of us have a seat, so you're gonna have to ride on top. Climb on. Why is your rover exploded? My rover has not exploded. That's the unknown signal. The unknown signal that you parked on top of, so it looks like you're on fire. No, I parked in front of it so that when it was rolling, it I would stop it. It was highly tactical. Yeah, I lost my H202. All right, Kabak, you might want to crouch. Perhaps even in front of that gun, rather than on top of it. Yeah, I'd ride on top of the cockpit. Uh, where is this place we're going to? Oh, look, 15 Ks. Oh, you are going to have to ride up there for a long time, Kabak. Where? Follow me. Really can't go fast with him on there, though. <laughs> uh, go nuts, I'll be fine. You'll be fine until I bounce or until I fall through the planet. If I fall through the planet, you're in trouble. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, the, the guns on this base were flanking the blast door at the end of the runway, which is in the back of a cave. As long as you don't approach it from directly in front, they won't hit the vehicles. So you're going to have lost your tools as well? Uh, unless we can recover them. I don't think we'll get there in time. It's possible. I mean, I am driving at 66 meters a second with you on my roof. And it's working. And a constant list to the left with my vehicle. Well, this is certainly a different perspective. <laughs> How does it feel up there? Uh, it's a little rough. <laughs> this gun keeps poking me in the back. Oh, there I go. I can see his base from uh, inside the planet. Yeah, that's how I found it. So just park up beside it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We see it. Oh. My turrets. Oh, um, yeah. Careful of the guns. They will open fire. So where was his emplacements? What the... Why are a bunch of my blocks deconstructed? Oh, I see... Are we gonna... Break in and raid this? Uh, I wasn't thinking we would. Kind of would mean open season on us if we did it to other people. Hey, mm -hmm. he shot me first. Yeah, It'd be when revenge. you invaded his base. No, I was just standing there. It'd be like if you go go press somebody's doorbell and a gun turret comes out and shoots you in the face. <laughs> <sighs> well, shall we uh get in the shuttle and see if we can head to space? I guess so. 
Because apparently we're not finding another base to attack. Oh, that's going to be a drive home. Yeah, we got to get home. Maybe we'll just get home and we can launch next time. Well, on the good side, my rover hasn't flipped yet. <gasps> Back to base, then I can properly put my puppy to bed. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, oh, oh no! 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 Oh, watch out, there's a big cliff over here. Oh, I lost my top turret. <laughs> Did you roll? Uh, I flew. I did not Flew. appreciate how quickly the terrain was about to drop away from me because it had gotten dark. I was like, oh, I'll slow down, and uh, it did not happen fast enough. I Vehicle's have still functioning, though. discovered... Where's the marker? Iron. How boring. Oh, Capac, please turn those off. What? <laughs> Just think of it as purple lightning. Whoa. What are the guns firing at? Oh. <laughs> you had really good timing on turning those off, Capac. Capac needs to turn off his lights in his rover. What? I did. No, they're very much still on. Why are they on? Or is I that kind know. of Jashi's that's on? Yeah, that's not even me. <laughs> and Capac, can you turn off your suit lights, please? No. I'm afraid of the dark. Kapak and Kanajashi are nice and safe in their two little cockpits of the Cerberus here. And that means I can talk to you guys about a few things that are happening and have happened in this past week, and a few things that had happened before the recording we did together. Now, the reason we didn't go to space during that was that I'd actually discovered that in the process of the servers merging and unmerging on their cluster, our asteroid base had managed to be deleted. And so I was hoping I could think up a way to get around that. I didn't come up with anything good. However, after much help from the admins on the server, we still couldn't find it. And then Idiot, who is the main admin of the server, and that's his name, that's not a description. <laughs> he actually had a backup of the base and it's now been restored so that means that i can now do some things on the base up there to get the boost bus ready to go and that means potentially taking this shuttle but i kind of want to take that with the two of them when they're both here so instead i've gone and built something i've built a really awkward cargo carrying thing on top of my attack rover uh, we won't really look too closely at that because it's top heavy, it's awkward, but it worked. And I was able to collect enough ice to fill the hydrogen tank on this hideous abomination of a shuttle. Let's clear these things out of the way. Because there we go. We have a single hydrogen tank, we've got a couple of large hydrogen thrusters, a few small thrusters in every direction. A gyroscope is hidden up here above the cockpit, which is down at the bottom. It's all attached by this rotor, which I should be able to disconnect from inside the cockpit before I launch. And hopefully make it to space. Now what I've put in here so far, if I pop in here and go... Ugly rover. Ugly rover? No! Ugly shuttle it should have been. Whoops. Oh well. I've put all the superconductors we've made down here put a bunch of water, some magnesium, some cobalt, and some oxygen bottles, which I'm going to take with us to space. Now, in the industrial cockpit here, I've got more bottles, some food, some water. Basically, I'm trying to stock up everything I can on the Absolution base, because that way all of us can move up there, we can get the... we can hopefully get the booze bus ready to go and start investigating the stuff to actually escape from purgatory. I'd really, really like to do that because there is a planned reset coming for this server. Hopefully, I've got enough time. Otherwise, I might have to get even more help than what we've got so far. But we'll see. We'll see how we go. So here we go. Uh, I need to grab all the ugly thrusters. Put them in a group. 
Uh, the rotor is locked, so when I put these thrusters on, it shouldn't clang out too hard. Whew. Is this going to work? Thrusters on. And detached. Let's roll. Up we go. Still accelerating. Can't see the pennants anymore. Still accelerating. Oh, got a good top speed. 183, all right. Time for overrides. 8Ks up. I think we should make it. Don't know how much fuel I'm going to have left. You might notice I've got a pair of oxygen tanks on this. The reason for that was the obvious oxygen running out issue that we had on <laughs> Absolution Base before. Hopefully this time, with having these pair of oxygen tanks, I'll be able to offload some oxygen into the base and hopefully start storing it, because I plan to make a few trips with this thing. I'm not planning on doing this just once. This is going to happen hopefully a couple of times before the next recording with Cap with Kapak and Kanajashi. Oh, it feels so good to be heading back to Absolution Base. With some useful stuff on board. 40% fuel used to get here. Possibly could have had a slightly more efficient descent profile, uh, but not too bad. I won't need much to get back down because I do have parachutes on this and I might add some more when I get to Absolution. Might go down with eight instead of four. What the? There's something here. Actually, are there multiple somethings here? Hold up. Uh, GPS. Ugly. Let me shuttle, just so I can find it. Let's first see what this thing is. That is a disconnected somebody. I don't know who that is. Don't think there's any way to find out either. Hmm. <laughs> I think... Given this person is not uh, dead or deleted, this might be Halo, who was one of the admins trying to help me out and sorting this out, or it could even be Idiot himself. I'm not sure. <laughs> but this is more interesting. I suspect this might get Capac's attention, given the colouring. Yep. Someone has somewhat remade a Phytotron. <laughs> That's going to be fun when Kappa gets up here. We'll all be in on it and he won't have a clue. Oh geez, I wonder what else people have put up here. Also, why is, why is our base broadcasting? I've got to fix that. It should not be broadcasting. I don't know why all the... I don't know why all the all locations are still showing up. That makes me nervous. Hopefully I'm back on the planet before I can get a Jashi come back so I don't have to make one of them fly. I suspect neither of them is going to be jumping at that task. Oh, maybe Kanajashi would. He might. Could be fun to watch them come in from here. There we go. Connector. Let's hook up. So the reason I'd done this with a rotor down on the planet was just to make it easier for getting everything charged and loaded up rather than having to build a connector and mess around with that. Locked. Let's turn all our thrusters off. Now, oxygen. It's a big one, turn on, and stockpile. Oh cool, that's right. Two small tanks is one big one. Awesome. So we've now got 2,000 cobalt up here. We've got a whole bunch of water. We've got a bunch of oxygen. We've got... A whole lot of silver still to be processed, right. So yeah, my plan for now is to basically spend my time collecting that gold, collecting that silver, manufacturing a few things up here so that when the guys get up here with me, we can snap straight to building and get that booze bus underway. I've managed to prepare enough superconductor components that we can build a jump drive as soon as we get back up here. But I just thought, since I've got a little bit more time available, I would go and collect some iron as well, build up a bit of resources so that we can hopefully build the booze bus with Kapak and Kanajashi in the next recording. 
All right, 40,000 kilograms of iron ingots. That's going to have to do for now. Let's turn off the refinery. Let's close up the base. Note that Twisted One <laughs> wrote something in here when I left the base open the other day. And head back to the planet. My return trip is going to be bringing some goodies back with me, though. In this cargo, I've got 5,000 kilograms of silver. The reason I'm taking so much silver back to the planet is I've got heaps here. But just in case we need to do something down there, it might be nice to be able to build a med bay. Might be able... Might be nice to be able to build a survival kit onto certain things that we want to bring up or use around there. So I'm just taking some there as a bit of an insurance policy to ensure... Attempt to ensure that we have some stuff there. Uh, I'm also going to bring back a little bit of gold. Because we've got gold up here. But that should be everything I need to bring with me. Got some food on me. Should grab my tools. Because I don't want to leave them up here. I think they're in this cockpit. Got parachutes. Ooh, I was thinking of adding some more, but no. No, I'm not going to. I've got two bottles on me, so that's going to be enough. Thrusters on. Okay, 56% fuel. That's not a lot, but it should be enough. Since all I really need to do is fly over the location where our base is and then drop. Use my parachutes to do most of the deceleration and then my thrusters for a landing. Now, where is Penance? There it is, that way. I really, really, really hope I don't lose this vehicle like I've lost so many recently. I know it's terrible, but it'd be nice if it could be used more than once. Also, I really wouldn't mind having some silver at Penance base. Set the parachutes to deploy it two kilometers up. So that's three kilometers to go. Hopefully, if they fail to deploy, that gives me enough time to stop. There we go. Deployed. Okay, I think it's got enough fuel for me to quickly do this. Grind off this advanced rotor. And replace it with a connector. The fellas are still alive. That's good. That means that next time we can head on up to space in the shuttles, take some goodies with us, and hopefully get a good deal of building done on the booze bus, perhaps even get the jump drive built. I'm not sure about charging it. We'll take the uranium with us and hopefully build a reactor as well so that we can maybe produce enough power to charge something that requires that much charge with a reasonable speed. We'll just have to see how that goes. There's all that and plenty more to come. And, whoops, we will see you then. And I recorded this earlier with them, so they will see you then too. Catch you next time, everybody. See you later.